when I was graduated from high school in 1986, I was only 16 years old. I did not know that how I'm going to do with my future. I was confused and I did not have a sense of self. My father assisted me to enter the Mandalay University. Mandalay is the second biggest city of Myanmar. At that time, I just followed what my father told me. Although I did not have a sense of future, I was studying for two years in Mandalay University. In August 1988, a countrywide pro-democracy uprising was happened in Myanmar. I was involved in that political movement. After the regime took over the country, I had to leave my hometown and seeking for asylum on the time in my border together with a number of students. My responsibility as a university student was forcibly changed to the, the forest life. It was a risk transition for me. I was feeling lost and I did not know how to cope with my forest life. How can I make such extremely investment for my future? I did not have enough sense of self to pick the direction. Later, I met a number of Orujuji who had been fled from fighting between government troops and ethnic troops. But O is one of the ethnic groups from Myanmar. I was re really glad to meet this for O. It is the entity that I belong to. This contribu can contribute me to enter into the traditional path. But O set up the the Hmong village, I was gradually integrated into new society which is different from my origin. I passed my day through involving with social and cultural activity. In 1992, Paul Refugee had moved into Makoso village in Thailand. At that time, I had totally entered into a space that growing inside with a clear future and overwhelming with sense of displacement. Then one day I discovered that I wanted to venture in the independent Senate. In September 1992, I came down to a town. I sold my labor to earn a living and rent a small room. One year later, I met my girlfriend, who is also from Myanmar. We lived together for three years and she left. In February 1996, I began I win a job as a translator at non government organization. Why most of the students went to the third countries, I chose to stay to help a old refugee in Thailand. On the other hand, I was as a social worker with NGO for helping refugee and migrant. I also work with an individual owner, namely Mr. Russ Christensen from, unit, from the United States in helping ref, refugee. On the other hand, I was seeking the, the opportunity for my education, which will motivate for my future. In June 2007, I began to study with Open University of Australia. Unfortunately, the humanitarian project that I worked for was finished in February 2009. While I applied for a new job, I was told by the organization that I need a former university degree. Therefore, I decided to study in four times. I have no job now. Once in a while, I got a few translation jobs to relieve the difficulty in making a living. So far, my competence and the opportunity, the opportunity have adventure. My experience have become a model of sense of self. But as a refugee, it is positioned outside the space of flow. I say get lost to make my own life trajectory towards a self for citizenship and living with uncertainty. I will say I wish that everything I have to be all belong, especially a stable life.